Hello everyone. In this AV, we would be trying to solve exercise 9A numericals. Now the first question from the numerical section says, a charge of 0.5 coulomb passes through a cross section of a conductor in 5 seconds. Find the current. So this will be done based on the definition or the formula for current I equal to Q upon T. Current is the charge passing per unit time. So to solve this, we first write the given things. Here, charge that is Q is 0 0.5 coulomb. Time is given as 5 seconds and we have to find the current that is I. So we write the formula. We know that the current is equal to Q upon T that is charge upon time. So the charge value is given here 0.5 divided by time is 5. If we divide we get 0 0.1 and ampere is the unit of current. So the answer is 0 0.1 ampere. Now we come to the second numerical. The question says a current of 1.5 ampere flows through a conductor for 2.0 seconds which is equal to 2 seconds only. What amount of charge passes through the conductor? So here also we will be using the same formula but we have to find a different element. So we write the given things. It's given that the current I is equal to 1.5 ampere and it passes through the conductor for 2.0 seconds. So my time is equal to 2.0 seconds. So we use the same formula and we write we know that current is equal to charge per unit time. So I equal to Q upon T. But we have to find out the charge which passes through the conductor. So we write this equation in terms of Q. So Q is equal to I into T. We have the value of I and we have the value of T. So we simply place the values. I is 1.5 ampere multiplied by time is 2.0 or 2 seconds. So we simply get 3.0 or coulomb which is equal to charge is equal to 3 coulombs. Now we go to the third question which says that when starter motor of a car is switched on for 0.8 seconds a charge of 24 coulomb passes through the coil of the motor. Calculate the current in the coil. So we write the given things. Time is equal to 0 0.8 seconds. Charge Q is equal to 24 coulomb. We write the formula. We know that current I is equal to Q upon T. We simply put the values. The value for Q is 24 divided by 0 0.8. So if we divide, we will get 30 ampere. Now we go to the exercise 9b numerical section. The first question is, in transferring 1.5 coulomb charge through a wire, 9 joule of work is needed. Find the potential difference across the wire. So to solve this, we will just write the given things first charge is equal to 1.5 coulomb and work done W is equal to 9 joules. Now this will be solved we have to find the definition of sorry the potential difference across the wire. So we will use the formula for potential difference and we know that the potential difference that is V is equal to is equal to W by Q. So we simply put the values work done is 9 joules and the charge Q is 1.5 coulomb so if we simplify it we can write it as 90 by 15 so our answer is 6 volts next question is 
A cell of potential difference 12 volt is connected to a bulb. The resistance of the filament of bulb when it glows is 24 ohms. Find the current drawn, drawn from the cell. Now this question will be solved based on the ohms law. What we do is we first write the given things. So we have written what are the things given in the question. Potential difference is 12 volt and resistance R is equal to 24 ohms. Now from so from ohms law we have V is equal to I R. We have to find the current so we rewrite this equation in terms of current so I is equal to V upon R. We have the value of V, we have the value of R, we simply substitute them. So V is equal to sorry I is equal to 12 volt divided by 24 ohms. So this you'll get it as 1 by 2 or 0 0.5 ampere. This is the answer. Now question number 3 of exercise 9b numerical portion says a bulb draws current 1.5 ampere at 6 volts. Find the resistance of filament of bulb while glowing. So for this first as usual we will write the given things. So the given things are current is equal to 1.5 ampere and potential difference is 6 volts. We have to find the resistance. Again this will be solved based on Ohm's law. So we write from Ohm's law we have V is equal to IR or since we have to find out the resistance we rewrite the equation in terms of R. So R is equal to V upon I. So we sum substitute the values. So it becomes R is equal to the value of V is 6 volt and the value of I is 1.5 ampere. So if we divide then we get the value of resistance as 4 ohms. Now the last question for exercise 9b numerical the question says a current of 0.2 ampere flows in a wire of resistance 15 ampere sorry uh, 15 ohms find the potential difference across the ends of the wire so we first write the given things as usual so we have written what are the given things current is equal to 0.2 amperes resistance r is equal to 15 ohms now we have to find the potential difference that is V. So again this will be solved from the equation of Ohm's law. So we write from Ohm's law we have V is equal to IR. We simply substitute the values. So V is equal to current is 0 0.2 ampere multiplied by resistance is 15 ohms. So 15 into 0.2 is 3.0 and the potential difference SI unit is volts. So this is our answer. Thank you.